Hey guys, how you doing? Um, I'm kind of um, upset as I make this video because <clears throat> nothing that we are being told is actually true. <clears throat> nothing the mainstream media is telling you is true. Um, I don't know what else to say. It's just not true. Anything they come out with is spun and respun and spun again. So if you're getting your news from any of them, MSNBC, ABC, CBS, whatever, CNN, okay, you're getting news that's been filtered and doctored. <clears throat> For instance, you've all heard about Polish president um, being killed in a plane crash and most of his top military officials in the crash um, go to the intel hub dot blogspot dot com and there's a video that somebody took minutes it looks like just minutes after this plane crash and also go to um, the truther girls that's on YouTube she she's got a YouTube and and she does some she did some research on this topic and there's a lot of, of questionable things that happened prior to the crash like a radar system being removed the day before they were flying into Russia um, the lights on the runway being moved the day after the crash back to their original place and the plane crashed in a forested area okay there's no concrete there's it's not in a in a you know it's it's out in in a forest is where they crashed and so but you, if you watch the video of this man and his name I'm not going to be able I'm going to butcher his name but Andre Madeira the guy that actually took the the footage of this of the crash you can see the plane the the wheels there's a a wing uh, some of the fuselage and he's walking through the forest talking in his own language russian language and and uh he translates it on his youtube video here into english and um, he's showing what's he's panning over over the destruction there's a few flames going still and he sees three guys in black running through the forest towards the plane and he hears them he hears somebody say please don't shoot us and then you hear three or two or three shots and then you hear laughter and and um, you see another guy jump out of the fuselage and run away from the the fuselage and then he you hear a, a pop and then he drops and so you know I don't know guys and the, and and then also the guy that took the video footage that obviously posted it up on YouTube and Andre Madeira was killed he was stabbed three times taken to the hospital in critical condition and while he was there he was taken off life support somebody unplugged his life support and stabbed him three more times and the Russian government says it was a coincidence and they're not pursuing any investigation still saying the plane crash was an accident nuts it's totally nuts and apparently Poland has rich natural gas resources and in Russia they have a monopoly on natural gas and and apparently the Polish government wasn't wanting to participate in in their in in I don't know the whole United Nations world government deal they thought we'll just unplug and use our own natural resources because there's abundant natural gas there and and apparently 
somebody didn't like that. But check out the video, guys. It's on uh, in the Intel Hub blogspot.com and it's it's archived on uh, April 21st I believe let me check that real quick just scroll down on your right side and uh, yeah it's on April 21st it's called a deeper analysis into the Polish president's plane crash I'm telling you nothing we're told and the mainstream media is just saying it was an accident you know What do you say? What do you do? You know? I don't know what to say. It's a crazy world we live in. But second guess almost everything. Do your research. Don't believe what the mainstream media tells you. They're bought and paid for big time. And I know people that watch it just soak it in. Oh, we're in a recovery. Green shoots everywhere. <laughs> oh, nuts, guys. Anyway, check it out. Crazy stuff. I'm just upset and I figured I'd make a video and vent a little bit, so... Take care. Have a good night.